Let's come to uh, that strike by members of JUSAC, that's the Judicial Service Workers Association. So litigants and lawyers have deserted the courts in Accra in uh, the second day of their strike by the Judicial Service Association of Ghana. The, my colleague Godfrey Tanem was at the circuit and high courts to assess the situation and the kind of impact it's having. He has the story for us. It is clear that the directive by the judicial for the staff to report work today uh, since uh, the strike started yesterday is uh, totally ignored. This is a very busy place at Accra Circuit Court and obviously no one can be found here. Both clients and lawyers are not here just because of the strike. And this is a place that you find people going up and down. A number of cases are here and today they are not going to be heard. Yesterday it didn't happen, today it didn't happen. And obviously this is going to affect productivity. In respect to your case, how is it affecting you? It's affecting me because my case, I have to go back to my house. Somebody is in my house and my things are packed outside there. Rain is beating my things every day. That's what is affecting me. That's exactly what is affecting me now. So I want the court to come back. And, and take everybody's case. Innocent people are crying there. Government to listen to them. The situation here at the law court complex is somehow different from the security court because here you can see some few people trooping in to find out exactly what is happening but obviously stranded because of the strike. But the judicial service staff think that they are on the right path while the judicial service, their employers, uh, believe that it is illegal for them to be on this particular strike. From the law court complex here in Accra, Godfrey Tanam for TV3 News.